Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And this is a reminder for the small amount of you guys out there that are on version 2004. And how do you know if you're there? Well, simply go into search in Windows 10, type WinVer for Windows version, and you will see the version number. If it says version 2004, bill number 19041 you are in the last stretch of your operating system um, next month is end of support for version 2004 it has spent its 18 months of support that means if you are there you will get the security patches next month in december but these will be the last one you will get and after that, you will be vulnerable to all sorts of, you know, security flaws that will be in Windows 10. So what about if you're here? What do you do? Well, the first thing to do is you should check your Windows update because you should see that it's actually going to tell you that a feature update is available for update. And so in that case, you will see here some panel is going to say, oh, by the way, we will push you to 21H1 or 20H2 or whatever version it wants you to send uh, send you to. So, of course, the best bet is 21H1. Um, and that should be there because you are really close. And normally, most of you have already probably be moved on because it's a forced upgrade at this point because you're going to be out of support. What if it doesn't work? What if you don't see uh, that version? What can you do? I will share with you guys um, the Windows download page. And on that page, you have several ways of moving on to uh, the Windows 10 operating system. So this is the page I'm going to share. I'm going to give you the link in the description below. You have the ability to update now from a button here at the top. You can try that. Or you can download the tool, which is the media creation tool, and use this tool to upgrade either from there, upgrade via a image that you can create on a USB thumb drive. And so there are several ways that you'll be able to upgrade from here. If it doesn't appear in Windows Update, if it doesn't show up, uh, you might need to do it in this way. Make sure that your drivers are up to date. Make sure that maybe um, you, if you use a third party antivirus, that it's working well and it's up to date also, because uh, if it doesn't show up, maybe something is telling Microsoft and the telemetry, your computer is not quite capable of going there. And believe me, if you're running version 2004, you can run 21H1 as this is um, so similar uh, it's small cumulative updates. One thing also that you could do, and that's another possibility that is available, but that one might not show up for everybody, is you can wait through November. Like I said, you're safe this month, and you will be safe pretty much through December. Um, 21H2 is coming up for Windows 10. It's going to be available this month of November. So you can also wait and jump directly to 21H2, which would give you a long support time until, you know, 2023, actually. So uh, this is something you can check out. But at least move on to um, 21H1, I think, is a good idea, as it works well and uh, everything's fine. And these are small cumulative updates that shouldn't be that long. So uh, if you are stuck at version 2004, it's time to move on. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.